Hi, this is Melody Nye of Mellow Farms. We're here with Pearl and her brood uh, Tuesday, October 28th, 2013. Um, because I fielded a few questions from uh, other people raising pigs and birthing for the first time, I decided to create a series um, of pig behavior, maternal behavior, birthing process videos I wish I would have had when we first started. So what I wanted to cover in this video, uh, these eight piglets are less than 24, year, 24 <laughs> hours old, not years. Um, and one of the things to know about uh, piglets, uh, they have some very interesting behavior. Um, each one of them right now, each of the eight, has found a nipple that they want, that they are eating from. Um, what I learned is that um, piglets are very possessive of their nipples and um, if somebody's on the nipple that they have claimed um, they make kind of a distress sound and um, the effect that that has on a sow um, a distress sound when a piglet's not getting the nipple of choice can sound very similar to the distress sound of I'm being stepped on or I'm being crushed um, and so a, a sow responds to act that sound um, and does a, a one or two things. Um, she will either reposition herself so that she offers up more teats so that, um, you know, one of the uh, competing uh, piglets will try to, you know, take an opportunity for another nipple. Um, or, and that's the uh, advantageous uh, reaction. Um, the one that isn't, and this happens very often in new moms, gilts that have just birthed for the first time, um, they mis mistake that distress signal for being um, crushed or stepped on or in distress, and so they uh, jump up. And when you have a group of piglets, uh, like this size, eight piglets, and you have a mom who jumps up in alarm or response, there's a good opportunity to uh, end up actually damaging a piglet. Um, so I would have, I wish I would have known that going into this, um, because uh, I didn't know with the first two that I could be part of the solution. Um, we usually stay for the first 24 hours uh, during an afterbirth, um, so that if it's a new mom. We can help shepherd uh, the other little piglets to safety while um, the new mom figures out uh, how to um, manage her brood. Um, and uh, also, if you're in another part of the barn and you hear that distress signal, um, you can <laughs> save your own self from harm when you're racing back to, to help somebody who's in distress and it turns out they're just fighting over their favorite nipple. So when I started this video, that exact thing was happening. And what Pearl did was she just repositioned um, so that she opened up the six teats on the bottom, gave you know better access, and one of the competing piglets just went to one of the bottom teats. So videos I wish I would have had when we started uh, raising pigs. Um, I'll continue on the series, but um, that's today's video. Talk to you later. Bye.